Scallops, short rib, and a parsnip puree is how we're starting dinner. Apparently there is a god. The duck comb feet and the gorgonzola cheese mixed in, and my mouth is starting to water. A shiitake and oyster mushroom risotto. Oh boy, that sounds good. Oh, <laughs> look at that. Then my head explodes. Oh, with duck, okay. Oh. <laughs> the gloves are off now. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, there's more? Oh, dark chocolate. The greatest chocolate in the world. And the paintbrush. Do you notice the paintbrush of chocolate see across the, the plate? See the paintbrush of chocolate? That is absolutely, stunningly beautiful. Uh, to whom it may concern, if I die tomorrow, it's cool. The Chart Room Restaurant and Bar at the Land's End Hotel. Our host, Daryl Oliver, says he's got a surprise for us and asks if we have any shellfish allergies. Okay. Food. <laughs> Lots of food. Now, once a month, the chart room hosts a thing called Uncorked. It's food and wine pairings for a very reasonable price. Oh, boy. Ooh. Any Anytime I see crab... Oh, oh look at that. Just, Holy oh, mackerel. Oh. Appetizer. Oh, jeez. <laughs> the Alaskan steamer pot is a fairly new feature to their menu. And, <laughs> boy, am I glad they're featuring it now. <laughs> for me, one of the great parts of a gourmet meal is the gourmet leftovers. That was awesome. I love seafood and ski food. Nothing says dinner after skiing more than protein and carbs. Tacos. She used the word halibut and tacos in the same sentence. Gigantic halibut taco. I can't eat anymore. Okay, I can. Ah. Okay, yeah, I'm kind of a pig. A finger licking pig. Why do they call it the Seven Glaciers? It's not that hard to figure out as soon as you walk into the restaurant. On a clear day, while you're eating, from the convenience of your own table, all you have to do is look around and you can see up to seven different glaciers all in one view. Oh, and then there's the food. Scallop bisque. Did she say scallop bisque? <laughs> <laughs> Jerry Seinfeld actually broke up with a woman once over a bisque. I don't blame him much. I don't know what I would do for king crab mac and cheese. It's already free. But I'm about to find out. So good. Tis a far, far better thing I eat than I have eaten in quite some time. Yummy face in three, two, one. Yeah instead because yeah, the views from the restaurant well they're as good as the views from the deck and I love the view from the menu to be quite honest it's got all kinds of Alaskan fare steaks and fish and the appetizer that's mac and cheese with Gruyere cheese and truffle oil yeah mm. oh yeah halibut with smoked onions and smoked tomato compote and for me that is wicked Steak. No Yukon mashed potatoes. No wine. No potatoes. No steak. Ooh, that looks good. The executive chef, Matt Zimney, who looks far too young to be this good, comments about what he loves Simply best. Like the noise and the, the chaos in the kitchen, yeah, it's still like orchestrating, orchestrating that with everyone running around and we're still putting out good food and, and stuff like that. I mean, it's, it's just kind of working in the heart of the kitchen you know, or the heart of the restaurant, which is the kitchen. So. 